I'm going to add the very last purple to this one so that it ends up looking like this one here. So the spot is right here. There's a bit of a gap right there. See if I pull these two apart, it doesn't gap as much as these do. Anyway, uh, so the basic, uh, what's going on here? To see if I can get it laid out nicely. Um, the orange and brown are going around counterclockwise, and the purples are going clockwise. So I want to add this last purple so that it is, you can see a pattern here, this one's on top of that one, that one's on top of that one, that one's on top of that one, that one's... And then you got this one over here. So when I add this one, I want to make sure that it's... This one is on top of the one that I add, and that the one that I add ends up on top of that one. So let's add this in, like that. Ta-da! And actually another way I could do that is, I'll pull this back off. And I'll hold up either side, really. Um, I'll hold up the purple, and then I will bring the brown up next to it. And there's an overlap right there. And I will put this through where they overlap, and then close it. And again, I'm going to make sure that when I close it, I end up with... Which way did I do this one? Oh yeah, so I want this side the left-hand side from my point of view, the right-hand side from the video's point of view, uh, to be higher and the this side to be lower because that matches the other ones on here. So this one is also coiled like that. And so is this one. Let's see if I can get them right next to each other. Yep, cool. They all match. And they're all the opposite of the way they are on here. Opposite. Opposite day. Okay, that's good.